Hi you guys, today we will be doing a video on me cleaning my kitchen. We're just waking up, we just got done with breakfast, and I have not had my coffee yet, so I decided let me go ahead and clean this kitchen so I can get my coffee and just chill out for the rest of the day. So, if you don't mind, subscribe, watch, comment, do it all. As you can see right here, I'm first sweeping up the kitchen right now. It's like the first thing I do anytime that I'm cleaning something because the floor gets so dirty. My daughter loves to throw food on the floor, so I'm just sweeping it at the best of my ability, trying to get all of that stuff up so I can move on to any other thing that's important. Okay, so right now you guys I am cleaning off of my dining room table the place that we eat at we all eat there every single day so and it's right by the garage door so it's kind of like a catch-all for things as well so I'm just cleaning that off really good so I can go ahead and spray it and get it nice and spotless Okay, so now I've cleaned off the table. I'm gonna be taking that box of unwanted mail that needs to be shredded and put it in my garage so I can take it to Office Depot or Office Max to shred all of our important information. Now I'm gonna be using my favorite Spick and Span. It is antibacterial spray. And I also put another spray in there so it can smell good. I'm gonna wipe this table down real good. And after I wipe it down, it's still kind of wet, so I like to go back over it with a paper napkin so it can dry up. Okay, so here I am unloading the dishwasher from last night before we went to bed. I do this every single day. It kind of helps keep the kitchen clean. So I'm just unloading it and I will be loading it with new dishes from this morning. And dishwashers are God's saving grace to earth. You hear me? Because sometimes I get tired of washing with my hands, but sometimes I have to do it if I really, really feel like I need to get something really clean. So here I'm about to put my um, dish detergent pods inside of the dishwasher and I pour a little bit of bleach, that Clorox bleach up in there and I, my dishes are so clean when they come out of the dishwasher. I just feel like that's the only way to really, really make sure my things are clean. So I do it all the time. That's just me. I know everybody like, that's wasting stuff, but that's on you. And I always use two pods. Sorry. Not sorry. I just grabbed the Ziploc bag to put the pizza that we had left over from last night in there so that we could eat it later. And I'm just gonna put that in the fridge. Nothing major, nothing big. Just washing off uh, or washing out the sink because it's really disgusting and I'm putting everything down the garbage disposal and cleaning out that sink with bleach and water 
And I'm also cleaning off my baby's bibs that she eat on, my toddler. And her um her high chair uh thing. That's her in the back running around. Bless her heart. But that's all I'm doing here. I don't put that in the dishwasher. I like to hand clean those things and that's what's happening. <laughs> dish water on the other side of the sink to wash those bibs and her um top to her high chair like I said I just put bleach water and some Dawn soap in there and that's how I cleaned it off for my baby girl Just taking the things off the counter and putting it on the top part of the counter so that I can spray the counter down and wipe it down. And then I'm going to put the stuff back on that part of the counter and wipe the top part of the counter as well. Um, I do end up putting the things away, but you don't see me doing it, but I do put it away. with a child like mine who consistently throws food on the ground so sometimes I miss it when I mop and it gets stuck on the floor so in order for that stuff to get up in my floor to really look clean and really be clean I had to get on my hands and my knees and make this thing happen um it really doesn't take as long as it may seem um unless you just have a lot of spots I did have quite a few spot, spots but it was no big deal um only thing that I used on the floor was some water, pine saw, and uh, Dawn soap to clean the floor. And I had, I had a little bit of vinegar, y'all, to get it really clean and make sure it was like, clean for real, for real. So this is the finishing look of the kitchen. It's pretty much clean. I mean, some things might need to be straightened up a little bit, but it is pretty much <laughs> Clorox down. And now I'm about to get me a cup of coffee, chill out somewhere, and be merry. I'm so, so happy I'm able to relax with a cup of coffee. sitting down drinking my coffee and sitting and reading the book of Job and the one passage really stuck in my spirit so I think God really wanted me to clean up and relax and talk to him a little bit y'all have a great day like comment subscribe and I love you guys so much bye